Hi fellow gardeners, welcome to Garden with Jenny. I'm Jenny, which I'm sure you know by now. Uh, so I posted a video yesterday of some stuff that I did in the yard. Uh, two days away from graduation. Woohoo! Um, so today I did a little bit of weeding because um, it's like another 80 some degree day and it's beautiful and the breeze is nice and uh, I wanted to get one bed weeded before I left to make it at least a little bit easier. It's really breezy. Um, so this is going to be really quick because I did a long video yesterday uh, just showing you the one bed that I did uh, today. So if you give me one second, I'll show you. So this is the bed that I did today. As you can see, my weeding pail is right there. Uh, five gallon bucket from value. I did a quick weed. This thing was pretty, not quite as bad as that, but it was pretty good with weeds. It took me uh, probably three, four hours to do this little bed because there was so much Creeping Charlie and something else that I don't even have any idea what it is, but there's a few weeds in there still that I didn't get, but it's a lot better than it was. Uh, you could see it in the last video that I posted. This had like so many weeds. I got a dead rose stump there. Didn't make it. Um, it got exposed. Uh, so you can see there's still a little bit of weeds in this area that I missed because I was interrupted a few times today but it looks significantly better than it was and these be these weeds are a pain in the butt they have these ridiculous runner like roots that are thick so you know dandelions have a deep tap root well these things have that too but they also have what appears to be runners like a strawberry plant wood or rot I think they're runners um, or whatever it is that root that spreads underneath the ground because I think runners sit above the ground it's the other one anyways I can't think of what it's called right now um, significant improvement with the weeds though and uh, now you can see there's actually individual plants that aren't like being quite so taken over by weeds anymore quite a bit of uh, hostas in this bed uh, so not a huge amount of flowering stuff, but, uh, anyways, that's what I did today, and shout out to my friend Chuck, whose birthday was yesterday, I believe he said, so happy birthday, um, and tomorrow my mom told me I'm not allowed to garden, well, not that she said I'm not allowed, but she asked me not to because it's her, um, one of her last days with me, so she wants to spend the day with me tomorrow, and then graduation day is Saturday. So, um, just wanted to show you the stuff I did today. Um, yeah. So, thanks for stopping by, and until next time, stay green, folks.